So what I basically did for post, which I was lucky because of my systems down, I was able to use Dehancer online. Now I have Dehancer for Photoshop and for DaVinci Resolve, but they require a GPU to run. But right now Dehancer is in beta testing out a web page version of their plugin. I was lucky that I was able to do that. So I brought everything in here. The one I'm using here is a Kodak 50D Vision 3, 53 Kodak Enra, Enra. I'll walk you through the process one more time on how exactly I put this together so if I come in here and load in another photo see let's use the same one here which is the Kodak Vision 350D right here. I had some issues right here there was some like this line that was kind of showing up here and it was from the smoothing modifier and it was basically cracking the actual geometry so I just kind of just you know let it go and then just come over with the touch brush and Photoshop and just retouched over it cleaned it up a lot so that was something that again sometimes you can just let that little stuff pass and then just clone it out clone brush it out within Photoshop I like this here now what this allows me to do is here I can change the look I want it to be a little bit brighter a little bit more decontrasted so like I'm probably liking this one here and this is just really simplifies the whole process right I get all these presets and stuff like that for color contrast and light I like that uh, color I wanted to have a little bit of that tinge of the green again I like that old nostalgic look it reminds me of my childhood I think this was a little warm I'm gonna probably go for maybe this one here and then I come in in halation and here is my halation I'll probably crank up my halation and crank up my bloom a little bit and also crank up my gain so I just crank all that stuff up a little bit more to get there we go I love that look at that green that green is absolutely scrum dilly umptious right I definitely want to bump up the exposure just a little bit more again maybe something like that I kind of like that and I think that's pretty much everything I'm gonna do here I'm just, so here's the original and then here's after really so that you know this dehancer really just gives it that look and I like this look so that's why I use this plugin just I love the old school retro look this is what I grew up with and then um, let's see here we got losses complete tiff I'm gonna do a JPEG here max best quality JPEG export that out so hopefully I think this summer this app will, will be available it's not free it's definitely going to be paid but I think it will be a lot cheaper than the actual plugin the actual dehancer plugin runs about $200 and it runs on Photoshop Lightroom Affinity DaVinci to resolve after effects premiere i do have a coupon code if you put in patrick lavar at checkout you guys can get a little bit of a discount there on that 